Hi, I'm Jeff Ludy, the owner of Houston Window Experts. If you live in Houston, hey, check out our showroom. We are located at 467 West 38th Street. Beautiful showroom with over a dozen brands of windows and doors to choose from. If you live somewhere else in the country and you're looking for a great window company near you, check out jeffslist.com. I started a website where I have a listing of great window companies all over the country, and we may have someone near you. So, hey, a question came up. A lady said, I've had some windows in my house several years now. They're kind of stiff. They're sticking. They're not opening. What should I use? And I did some research and I'll tell you what we love, what we use. I'll put a link below so you can go find this on Amazon or any other fine retailer you'd like. This is made by Sprayway Family of Products and this is their all purpose. Key emphasis word here is this is a dry lubricant, a dry lubricant. So you're gonna wanna use this product. And of course I'm using a sample window that's brand new that does not need any help. As you can see, this window opens and closes almost effortlessly. I like it, but to show you what you would do, Here's what you would do, is you would take the can off, the, the lid off the can, you would line this up with that little black mark right there, so you could spray on that, and then you would spray into the cavity of the window. Now, somebody lost my trusty little straw, the red straw that goes right here, so I'm gonna show you what to do if you lose your red straw on your can of spray away dry degreaser. I would instead get a paper towel, and this might be a good idea anyway, because if your window's already been installed on your house, you might have some window treatments right here. You might have wood or something. You don't want to overspray, get the stuff on anything you shouldn't get it on. So I would not spray anywhere like into the open. Instead, I would spray onto a paper towel like this. Then I would open the window. I would take my paper towel and I would ride up and down inside this track here, lubricate that really nice, I can smell it, I can tell it's working, and then it starts to evaporate. I can tell it's evaporating. In fact, this feels kind of dry already. I'd spray a little bit more there, and then I would put it in this side of the track, repeat the same process. And then of course, this keeps me from overspraying and getting it all over stuff inside the house. That's what's beneficial here. Just the two sides is all it needs. Then I would close the window all the way down, and I would repeat the same process over here on the top half. I would go up here and lubricate inside of this part of the track just like that. And I would do the same thing over on this side. Somebody's gonna get a very well lubricated window when we install this window next week. And now that I've done that, I would just operate it up and down. Oh, you know what? It actually feels easier. I don't know how it could. It was brand new, but it is nice. By the way, that'll take away squeaking. If you have any squeaking and stuff going on with your windows, that'll solve that. Now, last thing you should always do, I, I like doing this because I think it's just part of white star, what is it, no, white glove five star service is I like the Sprayway glass cleaner. This is what we use when we're cleaning windows uh, that we install. It's expensive, but it does such a great job removing the streaks. And just in case you got a little bit of that kind of maybe smudged on here, or especially if you were spraying it, then I would suggest you go ahead and of course clean the window when you're done. Now, I'm not gonna clean this window on video because if I do, my wife's gonna see this and she's gonna try to recruit. You get the whole story. Okay, if you're looking for a Houston window company, check us out, Houston Window Experts. Come by our showroom, look us up. Or if you live anywhere else in the country, go to jeffslist.com. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the little bell, and like this video. We'll see you again real soon.